And the technology can change in a heartbeat, mm -hmm. but human nature does not. The ways that people feel like they've got a good deal 10, 20, 30 years ago is still the way that people feel like they've got a good deal now. Good point. Uh, we talk about the fundamentals as to why anyone buys. There's, there's four key fundamentals. The fundamental of comparison. That's why people want to shop around, okay, to feel like they've got a good deal. Back when I started, they'd shop around in the three or four dealers in the local town. Now, through Google, they just shop around all across Queensland if they want, mm -hmm. all across Ireland. The next fundamental is value. Now, you know the value scales. There needs to be more value built in the product and the service to get the amount of money they spend to balance. There's the fundamental of scarcity. Hey, if there's any scarcity, people tend to want it because it's a scarce diamonds, for example. And, of course, urgency. So those fundamentals haven't changed for a long time, but the technology has. So now people can satisfy their fundamental need for comparison through technology, just doing a lot more shopping around. Mm -hmm. They got their value worked out themselves because they've done, what, 19 hours and 42 minutes of research before they've got to us. Um, they yeah. can actually, that scarcity, um, in, in fact, it's all the information. When I first started selling cars, and some of your listeners might remember this, the good old advice, listen, don't give the customer what they want until you get what you want, okay? Isn't, I listen, isn't that, isn't when the customer so emails in and says, can you tell me, <laughs> is the car available? And so what's your best price? No, we don't deal with an email. You just say, you, just, you want your best price, you need to call me. You got, you got to come. Okay? It's, it's, this, it's this, what's this constant back and forth tug of war of control. The yeah. customer wanted to be in control. The dealership wanted to be in control. And it was yeah. just this, this back and forth. And I, I feel like what I'm seeing right now, some of those successful dealerships, you know, during this time frame right now has kind of let the customer take more control or at least yes. the perception of more control. What are your thoughts? Yeah, I, I think the perception is they do have more control. Mm -hmm. uh, listen, 30 years ago, the only way someone could get a price on the new car was having to come in and speak to us. 